This is question 33. College Board is asking us about similar triangles, so I'm going to draw a picture of triangle ABC. Angle B is 88 degrees, which is just barely less than 90. And angles A and B are close. A is 48 degrees, and C is 44. And I checked, and those do add up to 180, so College Board did their question correctly. And LM over AB equals MN over BC, so vertex M corresponds with vertex B in my larger triangle, which I won't make quite three times as big. L, M, N. L, M corresponds with A, B. M, N with B, C. And L, N with A, C. And they're asking for the measure of angle A. If you've drawn these more or less proportionately, you see that angle L and angle A correspond. And since they're similar triangles, the measure of angle L equals the measure of angle A equals 48 degrees. So you would grid in 48. This is all about identifying the corresponding sides and LM over AB, MN over BC tells you that M corresponds with B. LN over AC, LM over AB, L is corresponding with A. So the measure of angle L corresponds with the measure of angle A in these similar triangles. College Board often asks you about similar triangles. This is worded differently from most of their triangle questions, but it depends on the same understanding that in similar triangles, the sides have the same proportions and the angles are equal. Come back soon for my next video. With math, there's always more.